in today's video i will be ranking and reviewing my top 5 acne serum i have acne prone skin at the same time i do have dry and sensitive skin and in case if you have you know dry or sensitive skin along with the acne problem you all can relate that finding a uh, good and very gentle acne serum is very difficult because whenever i in general like try out various acne serum i either end up with irritated or completely dried out skin because most of the acne serum work on the idea that uh, they should be drying out your skin and if you have dry skin this is not a good idea or sometime you know like the serum doesn't even work at all but i am very happy to have these five good options with me i have tested them out various time in the last 5 6 months all these five serums are equally good i really love them but to make things more easy and more meaningful for you i'm going to rank them from comparatively less favorite to most favorite now without further ado let's get started with the video so the serum to rank at the fifth position it is the purito centella unscented serum this serum has very watery gel sort of texture it is very lightweight soothing on skin and consistent usage of this product definitely helps in drying out your acne definitely helps in reducing the redness on your skin and yes over the time you will definitely notice you know some reduction in your acne and in case if you have those uh, red acne marks pie kind of acne marks this also helps you know to certain extent in lightening them and yes i definitely prefer this one over the original version because this one is 100% this transparent water like this unscented version is 100% essential oil free fragrance free and of course it is rich with the goodness of centella asiatica it does contain niacinamide and i feel that niacinamide is somewhere around 2 percentage or something because that's the standard uh, percentage of niacinamide which most of the korean skin care brand use has 2 percentage is fairly tolerated by most of the skin types out there so because of the lightweight texture it is suitable for all skin types that's dealing with acne doesn't matter if you have combination skin normal skin dry skin oily skin if you are dealing with acne definitely check this one out and now let's move on to the next serum and at the fourth position i have this formula rx uh, pad 20 percent serum and pad has an ingredient like this ingredient over here in short i call it as pad it is nothing but a derivative of azelaic acid so in case you know you find azelaic acid a uh, little bit too harsh on your skin you need something a uh, gentler but still very effective on your skin then this uh, pad serum is perfect for you so whenever i get acne and if i use it consistently for both morning and night routine i have seen that over the time my acne they do dry down and i don't get more breakout so slowly but definitely it works you got to be like little patient with this product don't expect overnight result because surprisingly it is quite gentle you know because of that 20% thing even i was little worried you know that what if this serum dries out my skin what if it reacts on my skin so just to be safe i uh, started with you know two three times per week usage then gra gradually i started using it daily so next i have the inkylist niacinamide 10% serum before i talk about this particular product i want to share a few things about you know uh, niacinamide and my skin So I have very hit and miss relationship with niacinamide. Uh, the first niacinamide, like the concentrated niacinamide serum that I tried a long time ago, was the ordinary niacinamide 10 percentage, and that serum broke me out. It gave me lot of acne, and so I was like, okay, uh, niacinamide is not working for me. Maybe it's not meant for me. I should uh, go down to a lower concentration. And then last year I came across the minimalist uh, niacinamide five percent serum. So I used that one, and uh, it definitely worked on some minor breakouts, some minor redness, and everything. But I didn't see it working on some stubborn acne. So I was like, what should I do? Five percent is not that effective. Ten percent is irritating my skin. 
and then this year uh, I came across this Inky List Niacinamide Serum like this has been in my wish list from really long time ever since the brand launched this product so this time I got to try it out and because of my past bad experience with uh, Niacinamide 10% I started with 3-4 times per week usage and then gradually I started using it daily and now I am able to use it for both morning and night routine very safely and it definitely helps in calming your acne it definitely helps in uh, soothing your skin it reduces redness on your skin so slowly and definitely this serum does work like you need to give it some time to see the good result and also i don't find it drying on my skin like if you have dry skin and if you have ever used concentrated niacinamide serum you must have felt some minor dryness on your skin but uh, I didn't experience uh, that kind of dryness with this product. So if you have dry skin or sensitive skin, highly, highly recommend this Inky List Niacinamide Serum. I think it's the best Niacinamide Serum that's available in the market. And uh, I honestly don't want to try the Niacinamide Serum from the Indian brand. For some reason, I cannot find my trust in their formulation. So let's see in the future what i do but for now i'm happy with this product next is the essentry spot saver mugwort ampule and again this is the product from which i really didn't have a lot of expectation uh, because before this product uh, whatever mugwort product i have used i was not at all impressed i found them okay so i was like okay this was yet another mugwort product it might not give the desired result uh, but um, whenever like i've used it consistently day and night on a regular basis on my acne or irritated skin it has definitely worked like it's gonna take some time but it will definitely work in calming down your acne introducing the redness and that inflammation that you get from acne so yes it definitely works and uh, it is quite lightweight in texture so this is why it is suitable for all skin types that deal with uh, acne or general irritation all the serums that i've mentioned till now they are like 100 percent fragrance free they are 100 percent essential oil free and apparently have this clean ingredient list personally for me uh, good formulation matters more than the clean ingredient list like even if you even if you get a product that apparently has clean ingredient list but doesn't have a good formulation you may not get the desired result so yeah know the difference between these two and coming back to this ranking thing the serum to rank at the number one position and i'm sure that many of you must be knowing and it is the some by me aha bha pha 30 day miracle serum so this is like almost empty i think i am only left with uh, this much quantity and uh, i will be repurchasing another bottle because without this my bad skin days are torture so this is the serum i just blindly trust because it always works and like even with you know just two application like two days of usage you will see some reduction in your breakout you will see some improvement in your skin texture and you will see some glow on your skin for the texture it has that by face solution like it has that uh, oil layer at the top and at the bottom it has a watery layer so this is why you know whenever you see me using i always shake it really well before putting it on my face otherwise you won't be getting a good result from this serum so ensure that you are shaking it well before using and uh, when it comes to that aha bha pha thing like I, I can totally relate if some of you freak out like it contains so many exfoliating ingredients it must be very harsh on your skin but this is why i mentioned that good formulation matters and also this aha bha pha thing is not at all in higher concentration so if you have sensitive skin or if you are a beginner it's always safe to start with weekly two three times usage and slowly as you see that your skin is uh, getting adjusted to it you can use it on a daily basis and at this moment i am able to use it like for both morning and night routine it works fabulously on my skin and uh, regarding the essential oil it does contain few essential oil but again they are in a very moderate uh, concentration it also contains some moisturizing oil to balance out that exfoliating effect and uh, yes it does contain some minor fragrance like it has that 
very minor citrusy fragrance from the essential oil and botanical extract in it but once you apply the serum on your skin the fragrance goes away completely so we have come towards the end of the video and uh, these were my top five acne serums and if you have used any of this serum do share your experience in the comment section below i would love to read them and in case if you are wondering where you can purchase this serum check out the description box right below the video i always link various purchase options so that you don't have to look around here and there and what else i think i have said everything that i wanted to share and i will see you in my next video bye